What's up guys, Renaissance here. Welcome back to Let's Play Sekiro. So, a little bit of a disclaimer guys. Uh, I've been really sick the past couple of days, so I haven't really had a chance to record much. Um, you might be able to tell from my voice, I'm a little stopped up. It's no big deal. Uh, we're going to try to power through this, but um, I also, I didn't solicit this advice, but I came about some information that kind of guides me on where the next areas, like the order of areas in which I should go um, in the game. So, you know, we, we unlock the Simpo Temple. Um, we have these areas in Sunken Valley. We have this Ashina Depths area, uh, Abandoned Dungeon, Ashina Castle. So, I just tried to kind of elicit some, some advice as far as like, hey, where's the next place I need to go? And as a matter of fact, this is the next place we need to go. So we're going to progress through Ashina Castle through the, oh no, he's going to see us, the Ashina Dojo, I believe this is, or is this the antechamber? Gotcha, boy. I forget which one this is. But yeah, so we're just going to, we're going to progress through here. Um, apparently there's a boss nearby here or something of that ilk. So we will endeavor to discover. Hopefully our sneak is good enough that we can still get away with this without being spotted. It seems like it's pretty good. Well, this guy's just chilling. Uh-huh. Now, have we actually gone down here yet? I don't believe we have. Um, let's go ahead and do that first. Got a lot of guys over here. Gotcha, big boy. One at a time now. I don't want to have to... God, these cameras. FromSoft cameras. Get out of here. <coughs> Tell you. I've been grinding off camera just grinding money and <coughs> XP points <coughs> not recently but I feel like I've gotten a lot better ooh chest <coughs> excuse me I feel like I've gotten a lot better at parries eel liver items and chests are always good sabi maru an ancient Kodachi short, short sword. It's blade modeled with bluish rust. Can be fitted. Oh, it's a shinobi tool. Great. Forged by the Ashina clan to resist the inhuman evil that had invaded Ashina in times long forgotten. It was the poisonous gift of the blue rust that finally drove the spirits out. I'm always game for... Where does this come out at? For a new prosthetic tool. Let us see. Uh, yeah, I think I recognize, yeah, because that's the way to where we got to go to the Simpo Temple or whatever. Hmm. Not sure if I remember these guys. Kill Spearbro first, for sure. <laughs> we don't want to deal with Spearbro. We'll deal with hat guy. Oh my god. No, no, no. This guy's like a mini samurai.
Yeah, I guess. Like a little mini boss. We have been this way, correct? Pretty sure. Oh, what are you gonna do? Yeah, we've been this way. 100%. So that's nothing new there. Have we been here though? Ah! We have not. Old grave. I mean, I don't want to explore this area too much, but I think we're going to anyway. This guy looks like one of those rats. No, no, I'm not a night jar. No. <laughs> a black hat badger. We've heard them talking about this guy, I think. <laughs> A fugitive, yeah, man, they're looking for him. Oh, you got the goods, huh? Iron Fortress and Anti Air Death Blow text. Iron Fortress and Iron Fan made in the war, made in the far west, can be fitted into the Shinobi prosthetic to become a working prosthetic tool. Experienced iron ribbed fan users can deflect arrows and even bullets using this tool, passed down through generations of assassins serving Senpao Temple. It wouldn't be surprising if the next owner decided its weight was impractical. Anti-air death blow, uh, shinobi martial art, uh, you unlock a skill which serves as shinobi is not bound by the earth and battle. Leap towards an opponent who has exposed himself in midair and strike, killing him before he hits the ground. And I think these are new items too, is this Yasha, Yasha Riku Sugar? Uh, halves max vitality and posture while granting a large attack power boost. Boy, that better be huge. Shinobi drug. Time's call for death by one's own hand. Oh, it's like uh, the soldiers back in the war times. They would, you know, instead of being interrogated, they would just, oh, we actually have one, but they would just kill themselves. 2,800. Uh, we can pop some stuff here. Can we just sell this to you? Oh no, we can't. Alright. <laughs> I thought we could, but... How much does this give us? 500? So we need two more. Yes, I'll take your Iron Fortress and I'll take your Anti-Air Death Blow. Oh, yes, I've heard about the rats. Trust me. Old timer cutting them up. Trust me, I know. Yeah, I know. I've met a long nose. Yeah, the Tengu. Alright. We'll come back to you, friend. <clears throat> I'll just look around here a little bit. Yeah, this is why I see you up there. Oh, okay. God, we're gonna die. We literally just got our stuff wrecked. <laughs> oh, come on. We couldn't even block that. Ah! Yo, this place is rough. How do 
we get back up there? Cannon dude messed us up. There we go. God, only 79 experience for... That guy's a freaking monster. Hey, I know where we're at. <laughs> That's a... Uh, old snake pit. 100% at a snake pit. Get my carry counted. Oh, you're the one who was calling all your little friends over here. Alright. No, never mind. I was gonna say it sounds like we got them all, but that is false. Very false. Y'all talking about Black Hat too? Look, I'm not telling you where he is. He gave me some good stuff. God, these guys hit like a tank. And they look like little mummies. Alright, is there anything else of value over here? Doesn't look like it. This is a small area. There's our destroyed bridge leading back to the Ashina outskirts. That is where we fought General Yamauchi. And then the chained ogre, ogre just on the other side there. We still never went back that way. Um, can't remember if we... Why Did, didn't we read something there that said like go away or there's like ghosts or something this way something like that all right well I mean unless we miss something that's pretty much it over here all in all though very productive area I mean being short well we're only 10 minutes into the episode <coughs> and I think we got some good stuff I don't think those are treasure cart. So the question is, can we go back up the way we came? Because I remember we dropped down. Uh, it might be too far, to be honest with you. Wait, did we go this way? Where does this go? Oh, you know what? This is the... Uh, where we fought the other little mini boss. This is, yeah. Oh, oh god. Oh man, is that really too high? Can we like wall bounce off of the side here? Are y'all following me? Probably. That would my luck. I'm wondering if we can't. Oh, we can't even see that grapple point. All right, well, that's fine. We'll just, uh, this won't take us back to the right one, but it'll take us back pretty close. So, <clears throat> we probably at some point want to go, because one of those, I mean, we found two friggin' uh, Shinobi tools. Um, chances are one of those would be effective on whatever boss or mini boss we have coming up but I mean if you remember uh, you know they told us that Kuro our little lord was at the top oh my god alright well I guess we're gonna fight you like we're supposed to fight you easy enough um, Kuro was supposedly at the top of Ashina Castle. Kill these guys again, no big deal. Oh, 
Oh, snap. Oh, you're a different guy. Oh, I bet we can run away from y'all. Y'all don't seem that bright. <laughs> God, man, this having this suppressed sound or whatever it is is just too nice. And then we just got you to contend with. Tell, yeah, I was gonna say that looks just like the one from Harada Estate. And you can tell, I mean, in a FromSoft game, first of all, they put it conveniently in between these two people who look like important folks, so. <coughs> and just like Harada Estate, it's probably a prayer bead. But I swear to God, I did not know. And just. It seemed too obvious. That's the thing with these games, man. If you just, like, pay attention to stuff, you can see a lot of the same elements um, within the game later on in the game. And same thing goes for, for other games. You can see kind of how developers choose to approach certain scenarios. If that makes sense. All right, so we got one, two... This will trigger. Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> I was gonna say that's definitely gonna trigger them, but yeah, these walls are like made of paper or something. Jeez. Oh. Mm-hmm. Trying to be sneaky with your gotchin sugar. So three baddies. I don't know what that guy does. Um, this guy doesn't hit very hard though, so preferably we'd like to kill him. Oh, is there another guy? Go ahead and open the door just in case they wreck us because there's something coming this way. I don't want to fight all these guys at once. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, come fight me. Okay, those guys forgot about us. Ah, they're the regular samurai. Oh, God, well, we could have McCurried that, but... Could have carried that. This guy's kind of a pain. Ah, man. I, I don't have much vitality, though. Yeah. They don't have a lot of vitality because they're not very well armored. But man, their uh, they're samurai swords, they don't feel good. <laughs> That's where we drop down from. I could probably only get one of these guys. Definitely only get one of these guys. <laughs> Got 
got you that time, Buckwheat. Man, once you get good with these Makiri counters, it is so useful to chip away at their posture. You just gotta know when to do it, really. Mibu Balloon. Hey! There's another uh, remnant here. State of this man. What man? Me? Rejuvenating waters. Kind of like us. Cannot fully die. Dragon's blood. Dragon's blood sounds pretty sacred. Now, I know he doesn't, uh, probably isn't a fan of it, but. Alright, let's see what we got here. Alright, this might be the boss I've been hearing about. Ashina Elite Jinsaki Saze. Okay. I hope that wasn't a mini boss I'm in here. Oh, prayer bead. Yo, I thought he was supposed to be hard. I I don't know much about it, but I just hanging scroll of an old battle. Ghost once lurked the lands of Ashina. The ghost lightning was of the fountainhead gods, unstoppable by normal means. Avoid ground, reverse the lightning. Well, that seems like a good uh, bit of advice. Lightning reversal. If one is standing on the ground, lightning surges through them, making movement impossible. But if one is struck while in the air, the lightning can be dispelled from the body and sent at an enemy instead. RB before landing. Lightning reversal. Hmm. I, yo, I just want the item, though. That's actually really interesting. Um, Yeah, if this was the guy, I mean, that that's nothing. I mean, does he respawn? We got... Well, surely not. Because he had two health bars, and we got a prayer bead, so... Let us see. Okay, so I guess we're going out. That just, what is that whistle? That sounds like Kuro's whistle. Look at this a-hole. Oh, can we get that item over there? Oh wait, no. I think I made a huge mistake. <coughs> Massive mistake. <coughs> Ashina Dojo. Yeah, we weren't supposed to do that. <laughs> I just, I couldn't tell if we had been there or not, but uh, we didn't miss that item though, I think. We could probably get it. We'll we'll check it out here in a minute. Yo. This is the dude from the beginning that cut off our freaking arm. I don't remember his name though. Lord Ishin? Soka. Mm, this guy doesn't seem like a Lord Ishin. Miko yo. Mou ichido yu. Where is the shinobi? Fushi no chigiri o ore to musube. To your immortal oath. Yeah, he wants to be like us, not being able to die permanently. 
Yeah, look, Kuro is like, no, Lord Genishiro. Yeah, listen to the kid, bro. I am his shinobi. Makes me sound like kind of a little, you know. Look, yeah, here I am. Impeccable timing, right? <laughs> oh well, let's not get carried away. So rematch. <laughs> All right, I think I'm more equipped to. I know how to parry now, so I'm more equipped to fight this guy. Well, palms are sweaty, knees weak, arms are heavy. There's there's no vomit on the sweater. Face me. Okay. Okay, that's a Makiri counter. Okay, that's not a Makiri counter. That is death by a thousand hangings. And this guy's got what, two uh, posture bars? Got one of his posture bars. Yo, this guy is rough. Stay away from that. Dang. I knew that was a thrust, too. Oh, where's your sleep? So I think this guy is very similar to, uh, oh my god, to Lady Butterfly and the fact that you're really only going to slice through his posture if you stay super aggressive. God, I keep, I mean, that's 100% my bad, but. Camera from soft camera. Jesus, the posture. Oh, I my key countered, I thought. I should not be blocking that. Come on guys, we're so close. We did it! Yo, first try. Get some. 
Mikos. We didn't do a Shinobi execution though, like we did on uh, <laughs> the last two. I don't know why. And, uh, oh, what are you gonna call your dad? Did we beat him? <laughs> I mean, excuse me. Lightning! Whoa! My dude is cut! I did not... Lightning of Tomo. Oh. So this is why the thing told us about the lightning. <coughs> Alright. Can we heal? Come on. Get it. Question is, do you have the same move set as your friend? Who, by friend, I mean yourself. No! Thought that was a. My dude appears to have the same exact move set. But with lightning. He's only got one posture bar. Dang. We died. Yo, his posture is like nothing, though. Is this it, please? Yo, oh, this is it. Give me that Shinobi execution. Yeah, right through the freaking chest. Look it, look it. It's nothing. Memory, Ganishiro. Extraordinary foe, community. As the code dictates, the wolf swore vengeance on Ganishiro Ashina. Blood smoke ninjutsu. Turns the spraying blood of a victim to smoke. Activated after a backstab death blow. The smoke screen allows one to retake the element of surprise. Life or death struggle defines a shinobi for whom it kills the source of strength. Smoke screen allows one to retake the element of surprise. Does, does it put us back into sneak mode? I don't know. Only after performing a backstab death blow. Cool beans. Uh, Alright, cutscene. <laughs> So this episode might be a little long, guys. I didn't expect to fight two bosses in this episode. Don't make me fight you too, Emma. Uh, okay, just making sure. Shinobi of the Dragon Air, dot, 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 exclamation mark. Oh. No, oh God, I thought I was done with you. What gave us the memory? No, this guy's slipping. Yo, look at those eyes. You're not a good guy. You're a bad guy. I mean, do I really have to fight him again? Shut up. Hi. <laughs> Deuces. Alright, guys. That's going to do it for this episode. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like, comment, and hit that subscribe button for me. We beat Ganeshiro on the first try. Give, give your boy a like. We'll see you next time. Bye.